Hey guys, we made it down to Gold Coast this morning. It looks like it's gonna be a really cool meet. We've got Techno HQ meet uh, cars and coffee going on today. Now Techno, they do sort of motorsport race cars, stuff like that. So there should be some really awesome cars down here. I'm actually down here by myself today. Um, I just quickly drove down this morning and it's an absolutely, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's an absolutely beautiful morning. So we're gonna head in really quickly. We're gonna go have a look at some awesome cars. Um, yeah, I hope you guys really enjoy and um, yeah, we're just going to walk around and have a look at some wicked cars. This is a Techno McLaren race car. That is so wicked. They have the best showroom here. So Techno have their whole supercar lineup literally just up here. And holy crap. These things are beautiful. Love is right here. Literally one of my favorite Ferraris. It's gonna be such a good video that you guys are waiting for. And this here is one of the Techno GDSRs. These right here are the last ever Commodores in Australia and they're bloody expensive. For anyone who's into like Australian stuff, that thing is mint. And then literally Sarah's favorite car. <laughs> I know she's gonna absolutely love this car. She got those rims though. Such a mint car though. M4 GTS. Holy. Such a mint car. Oh. <laughs> Got another M Sport right here. Look at this interior though. What? So you got the M4 and the M4 GTS in the coupe. And there's a Boxster GTS. Oh, so many cars I want to buy, god damn it. Beautiful Aston Martin here too. And then behind that we got the G-Wagon. Because everyone loves the G-Wagon. Most of you guys don't know this, but my dad actually owns one of these too. I haven't seen it in years though because he's moved over to America. This right here is a 1978 Ford XC Cobra. And this is like, if you're into Australian muscle cars, you get this. And some of them have recently been going for $200,000. Oh, RX-7 too. Oh, it's so clean. Look at the paint work on it. Holy, he's looked after this. Awesome little Range Rover just sneaking down the back there. Must be Sarah, again. These things are baller as hell. God damn. It's my absolute dream one day to have Techno do one of my cars. So expensive, but so good. Maybe you guys a better look at this too. All the airbrushing down there, holy. <laughs> I love the carby cover, it's so cool. So as some of you guys know, um, I don't really like to try and show off my car too much, especially at events like this, um, especially being techno racing and stuff like that. Um, my car isn't exactly fast or the lowest or something like that, so I just sort of get it off in the car park. But there are some really mint cars here, and I hope that one day, fingers crossed, fingers crossed, I have a um, I have a car that's like I can show off like this because there are some absolutely beautiful cars here. But yeah, hope you guys really enjoy it. Um, sorry about the fact that I don't record my face much at these kind of events, but um, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it. We got the Honda Type R gang. I do tell these things at work, and I absolutely love them. Those seats are so comfortable. Every single time I get to work on one, I'm so happy. I do have my favorite model of the C63. It sounds so good too. Ooh, old Mustang, I'm happy. So it was an absolutely awesome event. I absolutely enjoyed every single second of it. A couple of my mates showed up. Um, uh, Brett Willis from Empire Tent and Vinyl, who has a 760 horsepower ute. Um, he ended up showing up and, um, oh my God, there was some amazing Ferraris and just, you know, Mercs, BMWs, high-end sports cars that, you know, I just don't see every day, which I absolutely love, all those cars. Um, 
Yeah. All right, so I know I didn't film much at the car meet. It was an absolutely amazing car meet. I kind of just wanted to enjoy the moment. However, on my other camera, my Canon 60D, I managed to get some amazing footage, which I'll put into a little video, um, and I'll just make like a cinematic video. So that'll be coming two days after this one here. I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna upload this video, whether I'm gonna do the cinematic one first or whether I'm gonna do this one. Um, most likely will be this one, so that means you guys are pumped for the next one, because if I upload the other one, it probably means you won't be pumped for this one, and it's still pretty cool, so yeah. Anyway, I found a little cool spot to shoot my car. It's it's on like this little corner of an industrial area down at uh, down at Gold Coast, and oh my lord, it looks amazing, especially with the sun the way it is at the moment. Um, it's creating this amazing soft light on my car, like like oh, just look at that. And yeah, so I think it'll call it a day there. I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like, thumbs up, and smash that subscribe button. And if you guys want to see more videos just like that, I'll make sure to go to more Cars and Coffee, because I absolutely love that. Like, it was 7 a.m. in the morning, you know, I got out of bed at 6 a.m., got dressed and everything, and then head off at 6.30, and then basically the whole day, and I'm happy for, you know, and it's already 8 o'clock. So now I'm going to go and drive that beast and um, get some good photos, and I will see you guys in the next video which will be either something else or the cinematic video from this comment. Rightio, I'll see you guys later.